It's election season, which means you're bound to see political signs everywhere. You're probably also hearing complaints about those signs being removed. But could you actually get in trouble for moving those signs out of the public way? Our Donovan Lynch verifies. During contentious election years, it's common to see political signs disappearing, like what you're seeing happen in this video here. Whatever the motivation, could you face charges for what some may consider a harmless prank? Let's verify. According to Maine state law, Title 23, Section 1917B, a person who takes, defaces, or disturbs a sign placed within the public right-of-way commits a civil violation for which a fine of up to $250 may be adjudged. Still not convinced? Here's what your county sheriff, William King, has to say. It really is a, a serious thing to remove those signs. Sheriff King tells us that while it is a civil violation, you could end up facing related criminal charges as well, like theft. The people that are stealing the signs need to know that if they do get caught, they are facing a criminal charge and it's also a civil charge for our removal of signs, uh, temporary signs. The civil charge would be up, up to a $250 fine. The criminal charge could land them in jail for six months and or a fine of up to $1,000. So we can say, yes, you can be charged for stealing signs. And remember that signs don't vote, people vote. And all a sign is doing, it's reminding people who the candidates are. With your Verify, I'm Donovan Lynch, News Center, Maine. And if there's something you want us to look into, email us. The address is verify at newcentermaine.com. You can also reach us on social media.